Hello my lovies! Welcome back to my channel! Hello my lovies, welcome back to my channel. Today we are grubbing down on some delicious Peruvian chifa. We got Peruvian chicken. If you've never had Peruvian rotisserie chicken, go find a Peruvian spot and get you some because the I'll marinade, the marinade on this is chef's kiss. Like look, look at that glisten. And then it comes with fried rice. And then I also got some french fries on the side because i love the french fries and then the best part about this is the peruvian green sauce that you put on top of basically everything the chicken the rice the they need to jar it and sell it fries i know everything everything in the background is my sister my older sister mm, what's up guys um i'm already eating my bad and yeah, so let's let me dump a little bit of this. Oh, sale because it's a little, it's a little muscle here. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna give you guys the first bite of the rice. Give them some chicken. They want some chicken. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The rice hurt. The rice is fire, flames. If you're in Queens, the number one spot to go that everybody knows. Is La Casa del Pollo Peruano. In English, is the house of the Peruvian chicken. Mm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. That mm -hmm. chicken. So now we're going to start off with the lighting. And it's like fresh because they just opened. All right, so you see this beautiful, look at that. Like, isn't that not a beautiful piece of chicken? And then you dump it in the Peruvian green sauce and you guys get that bite. Ooh. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Oh my God. Heaven. Mm hmm. It's hot as hell. Like temperature wise. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Excuse you. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. My leg is burning. What? Huh? Your yeah. leg is burning? Mm hmm. Like when the chicken falls off the bone, that's how you know it's cooked up. It is chef's kiss, baby. And what I like when the chicken is fresh like this is that even the breast. I'm not a breast kind of gal, only the ones I have. <laughs> <laughs> but um, when it's like fresh and juicy like this. I like the breast. Mm. I don't like the breast because a lot of the times it's dry. I'm more of a leg and thigh kind of gal. I do like the wing part though. But, mm hmm, mm hmm. Let me get some fries. You want fries? Yeah, I ate two of them on the way here. You take the fries, you dunk it in the sauce. Oh my god, it's so hot. Ow. It's so good. <clears throat> 
I could eat. Sometimes I stop just to get the fries with the green sauce. Cause, baby. Chicken is hot. The fries are hot. Mm. So how are my lovies doing? What's new? It's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. Halloween is coming up. Are you gonna dress up? No. My dressing up days are over, guys. Back in my day. <laughs> when you become a mom. I'm not a mom. <laughs> I said when you become a mom. Oh. You're gonna want to do it again. Mm, well, yeah, of course, with my family. But, you know, I had my fun of dressing up. I was so many doing things. What is this here? I was a firefighter. I was, um, what's her name? Wilma from Flintstones. I what? was, yeah. I was Bam Bam. I was <laughs> um, um was Snow White when you were little. Snow White. And a clown. I'm talking about when I was like um, growing up. <laughs> I was Snow White actually two years in a row when I was little. Back to back because I love Snow White so much. And my mom was like, okay. Saves me money. <laughs> hey, no problem. You want to be Snow White again? Redo. And then, growing up, I was, um, what do you call it? What was that movie? I was uh, one of the things from Top Gun. I won. Jason. I was ready. Of course, all sexy versions, guys. <laughs> <laughs> the year I was Jason, we went to a Halloween parade in the city. And the amount of numbers I got that night. Because I was wearing, like, just a jersey. Wow. I used to go out with, like, audacity, guys. <laughs> Everybody likes a crazy freaky bitch. We're like, oh, this bitch gonna give me a good time and try to murder her. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> like, when I look back at my pictures, like the costumes, I'll post a couple here, maybe. Maybe. You should. When I like dressed up, I wanted like the shorter the better. And now, it's like, no, your booty's showing too much. <laughs> One little bend and you're done. But. That's what your 20s are for, though. I know. I looked up my 20s good. To be reckless. Especially Halloween. <gasps> But yeah, are you guys dressing up? What are you gonna be? My niece is gonna be Wednesday Adams. I saw. But the one from prom. <laughs> Get it right, not the regular everyday one. I saw Wednesday Adams is like the third most popular costume this year. Mm-hmm. Yep. Her prom outfit one. So the dress. You know? Even though it came with a wig, that one? Yeah, it came with the, the braids. Yeah, but that's not her right prom hair, though. It's not. She had it, like, tied back or something, Yeah, right? it was, like, in a low bun. Yeah, but that's whack. Nobody knows Wednesday Adams for a low bun. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I gotta buy the face makeup for her. I just... 
I just like the the song. Oh, dance, dance, dance. <laughs> you made it country real quick. <laughs> I know. Oh, you know what? I could probably use some translucent white powder on her face. No, it's gonna fall off. It is? Yes. Mm. That's setting powder. So, I gotta get white paint. I feel like that's gonna be too white. She's just a little pale. Mm, just get it like a lighter foundation. You gotta tell me what. You're the makeup person. Mm -hmm. I think I have like a light foundation that I don't use because it's too light. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I usually. The skin is my favorite part. You eat all your skin? Always. Oh, man. And I do it to rebel when I was younger. My mm -hmm. dad. <laughs> my dad would be like, don't eat the skin. It's too fatty. And that's the part with all the flavor. Mm -hmm. And I used to eat it regardless. So to this day. Or. I feel like this is why I eat it, though. Like the bread. He used to scoop out the middle of the mm -hmm. Italian bread. Like the puffy. You know, white part. Mommy used to do that, too, though. And. He used to be like, no. And when I would grab a piece of bread, he would take it from me and then wipe out the, like, take out the middle. So I feel like now I purposely eat just that piece sometimes. <laughs> Childhood trauma. <laughs> but sometimes, not all the time. I kind of grew out of it because it bloats my stomach. But So maybe he was trying to actually look out for me because, you know, I don't think I could eat gluten like that. It's not gluten. It's you can't eat the chemicals. I don't know what what it is. That they put into our food because when you went to Italy you was chilling. Mm-hmm. I mean you even came back looking slimmer and you was eating pasta and bread. I lost three pounds. Three pounds primo. Yeah and you was eating pasta and bread so that goes to show you. Pasta bread pizza. It's the crap they put in our food. Ooh child the amount of food I ate over there. The charcuterie boards that I ate. Charcuterie. They have spots just of char charcuterie. Yeah, mm -hmm. and wine. Like they have the a bunch part? of them everywhere. Yeah, because Italians believe in that. Because you know they have like late dinners. That's the best. Like, give me a good antipasto and a glass of wine. I'm chilling. So, no, I was eating my prosciutto. Mortadella, salami, sopressata, everything. The sopressata over there tastes different, right? It tastes like more like salami. Yeah? Mm hmm. I need to um, reopen my green sauce. Please hold. Oh my, from holding the friggin' <laughs> intermission music. Oh my god, if you guys want a good new novella to watch, download the VIX app, V I X. But this is like real Spanish, it doesn't have subtitles, so I'm sorry, but this one you're not gonna be able to watch it if you don't speak Spanish. Only if you speak Spanish. Um, it's not me, it's the app. <laughs> V-I-X, Vix, and the novella is called Tarde Lo Conocí. And that shit is so good! It's about a, vaginat a vaginatos singer that was a woman, and her name was Patricia Teran. Um, and, you know, back in the days, um, vaginatos was not sung <coughs> by women. It was very frowned upon. Only men sang it. So, Machistas. it's like about like her life, and of course they changed it because it's a novella. They have to add some kind of drama, but her life was actually really drama filled on its own. Like she was a single mom because she got pregnant by a married man, but in this married man, like she fell in love with, but unfortunately. 
tarde lo conoció. Tarde lo conoció. <laughs> Wait, she had his kid? Yes. When? Um, what do you call him? I don't know when her son was born. Right before she died. Her son was a baby when she, when she died. No. Mm hmm. Her yeah, son. just killed the ending for them. It's very real life. They can look it up. It's there. <laughs> She died at 25 years old, guys. Mad so no. young. She was murdered. Well, they can't. They never were able to prove it. But her tires exploded. I know she was murdered. Yeah, I think so too. She had a lot of people envy her. She was very loved. But, but the novena. I'm on episode. I think this is a fuse of bone. Um, I'm on episode um, 60. And there's 105 episodes, I think. So good. I've been watching it in the gym. <laughs> when I'm on the track now, I'm like... You know what I was thinking yesterday? I wonder what people think of me when they see me on the treadmill. Because I'd be watching the novela and I'd be like... <laughs> <laughs> Or I'd be like, I always be shaking my head because I'd be like, what a piece of shit, what a piece of shit. <laughs> so I wonder if they're like, what the fuck is this crazy bitch watching? <laughs> so it'd be funny because I'd be catching myself too because, uh, you know, I'm in my zone and I'd just be watching and stuff and I'd be like, I'll be like, oh my god, sometimes. <laughs> and I'll be like, oh shit, Christina, you're in the gym, relax. <laughs> Ooh, my job. Look at them. I tore this chicken up. Well, still a little more here, but <clears throat> I fucks it up. Don't spill there. Mm. I am. Where are my lovies? Don't forget, give this video two big thumbs up. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. Tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a friend to join the fam bam. And until next time, remember, let's spread positive vibes, good laughs, and yummy eats. Peace.